Tesla, the brand synonymous with sleek electric cars and a greener future. But is it all it's cracked up to be? Let's peel back the shiny exterior and look at the environmental cost of these vehicles, from the factory floor to the junkyard. Mining for raw materials, manufacturing, and shipping all contribute to carbon emissions and pollution. While Tesla boasts zero tailpipe emissions, a significant chunk of emissions occurs before you even slide into those luxurious seats. Is the electric dream truly green, or is it just a smokescreen masking a different kind of environmental impact? Stay tuned as we dive deeper into the real cost of Tesla ownership. At the heart of every Tesla lies its battery, a technological marvel that also happens to be an environmental paradox. These batteries, while powering emission-free driving, rely on materials mined from the earth, often with devastating environmental consequences. Cobalt, lithium, and nickel are crucial components of Tesla's batteries, and their extraction is anything but clean. The quest for these battery metals takes a toll on the planet, raising questions about the true sustainability of electric vehicles. As demand for electric vehicles surges, so too will the pressure on these finite resources, amplifying the need for responsible sourcing and sustainable mining practices. Let's talk manufacturing. Building a car is an energy-intensive process, and Tesla's sophisticated vehicles are no exception. From the metal frame to the high-tech interior, every step in the production line leaves a carbon footprint. The production of steel, aluminum, and plastics, all essential components of a Tesla, comes with a hefty carbon price tag. While it's true that electric vehicles generally have a lower carbon footprint over their lifespan compared to gasoline-powered cars, the initial production phase can be carbon intensive. Only then can we truly assess the environmental impact of electric vehicles. All right, so you've got your Tesla, a shiny symbol of green technology parked in your driveway. You plug it in, the battery guzzles up electricity, and you're ready to hit the road feeling all eco-conscious. But hold on a second. Have you ever stopped to wonder where that electricity actually comes from? Here's the catch. The environmental friendliness of your electric vehicle is directly tied to how your electricity is generated. If you're juicing up your Tesla with power from a coal-fired power plant, those emission-free miles start to look a little less pristine. It's a classic case of out of sight, out of mind, but the planet doesn't care about our convenient blind spots. Section 2. Renewables versus Reality, Bridging the Gap. Now, before you despair and swear off electric vehicles altogether, let's talk about the renewable energy revolution. The good news is that the world is shifting towards cleaner sources of energy like solar, wind, and hydropower. However, the transition to a 100% renewable energy grid is a work in progress, and it varies significantly from region to region. So, while it's great to visualize your Tesla running on sunshine and breezes, the reality is that it's likely still drawing at least some of its power from less than ideal sources. This doesn't diminish the importance of electric vehicles in reducing emissions, but it does highlight the need to accelerate the transition to renewable energy sources. Section 3, the global energy mix. Location, location, location. Here's another wrinkle in the electric vehicle equation. The environmental impact of your Tesla can vary dramatically depending on where you live and charge it. If you're cruising around Norway, where a large portion of electricity comes from hydropower, you can feel pretty good about your green driving credentials. However, if you're navigating the urban jungle of a coal-dependent city, the environmental equation looks a lot less rosy. The takeaway here is that the greenness of your Tesla is inherently tied to the energy mix of your region. Section 1. Battery of Lies, the true cost of power. Let's talk batteries, the beating heart of every Tesla. These technological marvels, while powering those emission-free miles, come with their own set of environmental baggage. Mining these materials often involves digging vast open-pit mines, scarring the landscape, and displacing communities. And let's not forget the toxic byproducts of the mining and refining processes, which can pollute water sources and harm wildlife. Manufacturing those high-tech batteries requires a tremendous amount of energy, often generated from fossil fuels. The environmental cost of battery production 
is a hefty price to pay for those emission-free miles. Section 2. The Dirty Secret of Disposal, A Toxic Legacy So, your Tesla's battery has finally given up the ghost after years of faithful service. What happens to those massive batteries once they've reached the end of their lifespan? It's a question that often gets swept under the rug in the electric vehicle hype. These batteries are packed with toxic materials that can contaminate soil and groundwater if not handled properly. Recycling is touted as the solution, but it's not as straightforward as tossing your aluminum cans in the blue bin. As millions of electric vehicles hit the roads and eventually retire, we risk creating a mountain of toxic waste if we don't figure out how to handle these batteries responsibly. Section three, the price tag of progress, can we afford it? Let's talk dollars and cents, or rather the hefty price tag that comes with Tesla's brand of innovation. Sure, those sleek electric cars scream luxury and cutting edge technology, but all that coolness comes at a cost. And we're not just talking about the sticker price. The environmental costs we've discussed, from mining to battery production to disposal, don't just disappear into thin air. They represent real economic and social burdens that someone, somewhere, has to bear. Tesla's high-end electric vehicles, while aspirational for many, are simply out of reach for the average consumer. The price of innovation in this case is a complex equation that factors in not just the monetary cost, but also the environmental and social implications. Section 1, the battery's second life, recycling hopes and hurdles. So your Tesla has reached the end of its electric journey. But wait, before you send your beloved EV off to the great scrapyard in the sky, let's talk about what happens to its most valuable component, the battery. Those hefty lithium ion batteries, the powerhouses behind your emission-free miles, still hold a lot of juice, even after their life in your car is over. Recycling these batteries isn't as simple as tossing your empty soda can in the blue bin, though. These recovered materials can then be used to create new batteries, reducing the need to mine virgin resources and lessening the environmental burden of EV production. However, battery recycling is still in its early stages, facing challenges like high costs, technological hurdles, and a lack of standardized processes. Section two, from road to rubble, the challenges of EV dismantling. Before those precious batteries can embark on their second life, they need to be carefully extracted from the EV carcass. Dismantling an electric vehicle isn't your average trip to the junkyard. These vehicles are packed with high voltage systems, flammable electrolytes, and a whole lot of components that require specialized handling. Proper dismantling requires trained technicians, specialized equipment, and strict safety protocols to prevent accidents and environmental contamination. This specialized dismantling process adds another layer of complexity and cost to EV recycling, highlighting the need for investment in infrastructure and training. Section three, a circular economy for EVs, closing the loop on sustainability. The ultimate goal for a truly sustainable EV future is to create a closed loop system where materials are constantly cycled and reused, minimizing waste and environmental impact. Imagine a world where your old Tesla battery gets reincarnated as a power storage unit for a solar farm, or the aluminum body is reborn as a sleek new e-bike frame. This concept, known as a circular economy, aims to break free from the traditional linear model of take, make, dispose, and embrace a more regenerative approach. Achieving the circular vision requires collaboration between automakers, recyclers, policymakers, and consumers. Automakers need to design vehicles with end of life in mind, using easily recyclable materials and standardizing components to simplify dismantling. And consumers? Well, we need to demand transparency and accountability from the companies we support, making conscious choices that prioritize sustainability throughout the entire life cycle of our products. Section one, built to last, questioning Tesla's build quality. Tesla, the name conjures up images of sleek futuristic vehicles, but what about their durability? While Tesla boasts cutting edge technology, whispers of quality control issues have dogged the brand, leaving some to wonder if these vehicles are built to last or prone to early breakdowns. 
Online forums are abuzz with tales of misaligned body panels, paint imperfections, and quirky electronic glitches that plague some Tesla owners. While these issues might seem like minor annoyances, they raise questions about Tesla's manufacturing processes and long-term reliability. Addressing these quality control concerns is crucial for Tesla to establish a reputation for building not just innovative, but also dependable vehicles that stand the test of time. Section 2. Autopilot's Blind Spots – When Self-Driving Goes Wrong Tesla's autopilot system, with its promise of autonomous driving, has captured the imagination of tech enthusiasts and weary drivers alike. However, this futuristic feature has also been at the center of controversy, involved in a number of high-profile accidents that have raised concerns about its safety and limitations. While Tesla maintains that Autopilot is a driver assistance system that requires constant monitoring, critics argue that the company's marketing has overhyped its capabilities, leading some drivers to become overly reliant on the technology. It's like giving someone a powerful tool without a proper safety briefing. Accidents are bound to happen. The tragic incidents involving Autopilot have exposed the limitations of current self-driving technology and the potential consequences of human error when these systems fail. These events serve as a stark reminder that even the most sophisticated technology is not infallible and that human judgment and responsibility remain paramount. As Tesla continues to refine its autopilot system, it's crucial to prioritize safety, transparency, and responsible communication to ensure that drivers understand the limitations of this technology and use it safely and responsibly. Section 3. The human factor, balancing innovation with responsibility. In the rush to embrace the electric vehicle revolution, it's easy to get swept up in the hype and overlook a crucial element, the human factor. Tesla's innovative vehicles, while pushing the boundaries of technology, also present new challenges and responsibilities for drivers and policymakers alike. One concern is the potential for distracted driving. Tesla's large touchscreens, while offering a sleek interface, can also be a source of distraction for drivers diverting their attention from the road. It's like trying to read a book while riding a roller coaster. Thrilling, perhaps, but not exactly a recipe for safe driving. Another concern is the potential for over-reliance on autopilot. While this system can enhance driver safety in certain situations, it's crucial for drivers to remain vigilant and understand its limitations. Treating autopilot as a fully autonomous system can have dangerous consequences, as evidenced by past accidents. As Tesla continues to innovate, it's essential to prioritize driver education and design vehicles that promote safe driving habits. The future of transportation depends not just on technological advancements, but also on responsible human behavior behind the wheel. Section 1. The Allure and Illusion of Green Tech We love a good redemption story, especially when it involves saving the planet. Tesla, with its sleek electric vehicles and aura of innovation, has captivated our collective imagination, offering a glimpse of a future where technology liberates us from our fossil fuel dependence. But as we've peeled back the layers of this green tech fairy tale, we've encountered some inconvenient truths. The environmental cost of those shiny Teslas, from the mines to the factory floor to the recycling plant, is a stark reminder that even the most well-intentioned technologies come with a footprint. It's like discovering that your organic cotton t-shirt traveled halfway around the world, leaving a trail of carbon emissions in its wake. The allure of sustainability can sometimes blind us to the complex realities behind those eco-friendly labels. The Tesla story is a cautionary tale, reminding us that there's no such thing as a free lunch, especially when it comes to the environment. The pursuit of a sustainable future requires more than just switching to electric vehicles. It demands a fundamental shift in our consumption patterns, our energy sources, and our understanding of true sustainability. Section two, the true cost of sustainability, a shared responsibility. The environmental burden of our technological advancements can't be ignored. The true cost of sustainability goes beyond the sticker price of an electric vehicle. It's about the communities displaced by mining operations and ecosystems scarred by resource extraction. Hidden costs are often borne by those who benefit least. We're all complicit in this system. Sustainability is a shared responsibility requiring conscious choices.
Section three, navigating the road ahead, informed choices for a sustainable future. So where do we go from here? Electric vehicles hold promise as a cleaner transportation alternative. We must promote renewable energy sources, rethink transportation systems, invest in public transport, bike lanes, and walkable cities. The road to a sustainable future is paved with informed choices and collective action.